On July 24th, a nutcase walked into a hospital in Darby, Pennsylvania, intent on killing as many people as possible. But the gunman hadn't counted on the fact that his number one intended target, his doctor, had defied hospital policy and was carrying a gun of his own. Dr. Lee Silverman is a lawful permit holder who regularly carries a handgun. Having come under fire, he crouched behind a desk and shot back, hitting the perp three times in the midsection. Even though the bad guy was able to murder one person, authorities have credited Dr. Silverman with halting a mass shooting in progress. The local police chief said that if Dr. Silverman had not been armed, the killer would have gone out in the hallway and just walked down the offices until he ran out of ammunition. Similarly, the district attorney said that if Dr. Silverman had not brought his handgun to work, then he'd be dead and so would other people in that facility. Of course, all of this just shows the failure of gun control. The medical facility is a gun-free zone. No one except police can be armed. But criminals, thugs, and mental wackos don't care about gun-free zones. They don't care about gun bans or background checks or anything else that would restrict their ability to illegally possess weapons. Plus, the Darby killer had a long criminal record and he'd been involuntarily committed three times over the past few years. All of this should have kept him from legally owning or possessing firearms, but it didn't stop him from illegally possessing several firearms that day in July. So help expose the lie. Gun control does not make people more safe. Join Gun Owners of America by going to gunowners.org on the internet and make sure you sign up for GOA's free email alerts.